So welcome then again to uh, Writing with New Media, an introduction to multimodal composing. I'm once again Shannon Carter and I've asked you to look at two different videos. One, this uh, polyphoto essay, it's just two minutes, and then this uh, example of dig to digital storytelling. Um, in this example, then, I was hoping that you guys would look at the seven elements of digital storytelling and see, uh, in terms of the story that's offered here, how that story uh, meets these elements, these standards. Does it offer a point of view? Does it offer a suggested dramatic question? Where's the emotional content? What about the voice, the sound, uh, the economy and pacing that we discussed earlier? I'd like to suggest that, um, of course, we have a point of view. The point of view is the, is the point of view of the sun. But the economy, I think, is the thing that is really most interesting about this. That uh, the author here uses the idea of these poly photos, these, these, these photos that exist um, side by side on sheets, as both a study and kind of economy and, in, and in this, as a study of family. What role did this image have? They certainly draw her attention to the fact that these images would have been taken right at the war and that, that, her, uh, that his mother thought it was frivolous that his father took that picture. We know something from this just this sheet of images about the uh, about the loss of his father, and um, I want to I want to look at some of the ways that he um, tells this story visually that I think really attend to point of view um, and the layer of the dramatic question offer emotional content certainly offer us the voice um, and the pacing. So um, let's take a look together at those elements. Notice how he how he works to uh, bring this storytelling effort forward. He shows us these images side by side, bringing them together so we actually see her moving. We see them back to back. Um, and so he shows us not only what's possible, but um, we can see her working. He quotes her and where it tells us where the pictures go and that we've forgotten about the pictures and um, uh, he draws our con us into the context. Then his father joins the picture and we learn about how they met. And he introduces them through these pictures, likewise drawing our attention to the picture time at which these images were taken. And we know something about who she was. The blitz is on. She had been evacuated and um, then she disappears because she's gone. Ooh. Dad goes to the war. We learn about um, their separation. Dad takes the story. And then we learn that it's the 1950s and his mother had multiple sclerosis. And we can see, look, um, the, the, the merging of the two. And we learn something about um, uh, the way image life took her away. Um, and we hear her uh, listening to recordings, and we hear her. Um, we hear something about her funeral after we hear something about her uh, reading uh, Shakespeare and listening to records, and then the audio, the the voice, the power of voice. It's his. It's his own voice um, that sing, that does the soundtrack. Him as a child when he would have known his mother and then his mother disappears. We have very little uh, archival op options here. I mean, very very little is available to, to uh, for him to tell this story. I mean, there may have been more, but, but the story is about the story that's told through this polyphoto, the sheet of images that's taken back to back that gives us almost uh, a still image and also a moving image of his mother that's no longer with us. Um, and so... Um, yes, I would say that in all these cases, it offers the point of view, the sons, the dramatic question is where, you know, his, his mother's here, what happened to her, the emotional content, his mother and their, their relationship and her, and she's gone. Both the voice of his singing voice and the voice of his mother are together here. Um, the sound being the, uh, the recording of himself 40 years ago speaking an economy 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 all we have is two sheets of images and it makes it work the pace is fast the story is told in only two minutes so i'd say yeah it meets all the seven story elements of storytelling